people still live completely normal lives despite having this virus and having to take medications. And although you know it's different, you know we say it's a chronic disease, but it is. Uh, aside from taking medication, you can still do the things you used to do. People will still travel the world. People still get married. People, you can still have children, and you can have children who don't have HIV. There's ways we can prevent kids from getting HIV. More and more studies showing that the sooner people are diagnosed, um, and the sooner they can get treated, you actually can reduce new infections. So we need to find a way to get people tested, and a lot of that's awareness by. Uh, you know, encouraging people to get tested, letting them know it's not a death sentence. There's more than 25 different medications available that act on, you know, there are six or seven different, what we call classes of medications, so they act at different parts of the viral cycle. We don't have a cure right now, but we have, through all these different medications, we can put the virus to sleep. And when, by putting the virus to sleep, patients' immune systems can come back to normal or near normal. And in fact, there's some, you know, more and more studies that are showing in terms of life expectancy. If we can put that virus to sleep and, and people are able to take their pills, then um, their life expectancy can almost be that of someone who doesn't have HIV.